Scene one, Apple, take two. <laughs> now we get to go to the angry part of the wasteland. Subway Town, I believe is what they said it's called. Glad you decided to join us. Well, I didn't decide to do because shit. I'm just on toe. Glad you've heard the expression out of the frying pan. Well, welcome to the fire. And I call that. And I'm not with you. I'm just next to you. Just so happens that the authority shoots at me. Therefore, I shoot back. And well, you don't shoot at me, so I'm friendly. Fighting the authority is all I know. I've been doing it ever since my arm emerged. And I see you haven't gotten any better at it. Nothing like this was supposed to happen after the asteroid hit. For once, our government had a good plan and good people in place to make it happen. But General Cross changed the time into only a few arcs. Arcs spilled with his people. That changed the course of humankind. Of course. Now, it's our job to make sure it isn't forever. No, it's kind of too late for that. I'm going to go out on a limb and say it's a little bit too late. That might just be me, though. Oh, good. Say that out loud again, you know, louder, so everyone can hear it. Survival tip. Sell, sell your junk to buy new stuff. Alright, come this way. What if I don't want to? You're just gonna sit there and wait for me? That door. How special. You have yourself a fort. Apparently that's all you need to uh, be a resistance is you just need a fort. I should build myself a fort under the backyard deck and then I can be part of the resistance too. Our guest. <laughs> Come on, dude. A wide load coming through. Holy crap. Hey, what do you have to say for yourself? Nothing? Okay. I'm also a little strange. Nope. Oh, I see it now. Nice to meet you. Yes, sir. Captain Marshall was buried in that thing. But I've re rigged the systems, and now I can track most authority movements and communicate with our people around the wasteland. Precisely. You're so smart. Elizabeth, you know. Good to see you again. And still in one piece. You, are you disappointed? Actually, it's Dr. Cadence. She's been getting closer to solving the riddle of the authorities' work with the mutants. Every little step brings me closer to the truth. They're fiddling. They're fiddlers. They like to fiddle with things. It's as simple as that. It shoots or explodes. You can help you with it. Ooh, good thing. That's right, friend. And like you're gonna be my friend. Oh, you are fully loaded. Look at that belt. That's a power belt right there. Lastly, above us, keeping a lid tightly closed on our base of operations is Saul. He runs the garage in town, and he's already got your stuff in a bag. Nice. I'm gonna guess and say that includes my Caprino. Town above us. No, missing Wellspring. They walk a fine line by keeping the authority at bay and also dealing with us. They'll have to be careful there. And the town's boss, Redstone. Be extra careful around him. He'd sell you out to the authority in a heartbeat unless you're abused to him. Ha <laughs> ha! Good times. Oh, where'd... Where'd what's her name go? Ah, oh, there she is. What do you got over here? Anything good? Oh, he's all funkily. Get yourself a science experiment over here, I see. Nice, computer off the side, that's for porn. Look down here, anything of interest? Nothing? Alright. It's just a random hallway with a leaky pipe. I want to get someone on that. Could cause issues down the line. 
Oh, dude, they got that... This guy's on a chair. Look at this. It's, they got that straight out of Alien Resurrection. <laughs> That's awesome. Decrypting this ID drive is serious business. I need to focus. Well, do that then. What does this guy have to say for himself? Blowing stuff up and hitting the authority where it hurts. That's my game. My game too! Now, if you're as good as Elizabeth says you are, then I do believe you and I will get along nicely. Oh, yes, we will. Wait till you see my shotgun. It shoots it grenades out. <laughs> like, here's the secret. This is how you deal with the authority. Case solved. Okay, so the first thing you need to do is get on Redstone's good side. See if he needs anything, and you get used to him. Otherwise, you're as good as dead, and then you're useless to us. Think you'll be able to play his game? Alright. Redstone. Good. Remember, get a feel for how things work around here. Be useful to them. Then we can start moving on to the serious stuff. Okay, it's clear for you to go up. Well, it's clear for me to go up now. Alright, I've been given permission. I'm special now, apparently we, this is what this is. What, that's it? It's just... Alright, gonna be interesting to see what it does. That's it? Oh, okay, I was gonna say. I was gonna say, it, it, it uh... Okay, it, 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 it conceals itself. I'm gonna say, what the fuck? You're the new team member. Well, welcome to Subway Town. I'm Saul. I run the garage here, but uh, more importantly, I dropped that car lift if the authorities start stooping around. But first, um, a couple of things you need to know. Your garage bay is through that door. Awesome. I'll all your repairs here and tow you back if you ever get yourself in trouble. <laughs> you can find the race manager downstairs and the bars on this level. More importantly for you, Redstone's office is upstairs. Remember, nothing and no one moves around here without his okay. So, don't waste any time. Go and see him. <laughs> That's me now. No excuses. Alright, whoa. That's a big ass generator. That's a boss generator right there. Uh, garage. Don't need that just yet. Let's see what this big guy needs. This redstone character. Town? We'll right. give you the first clue. I guess I should say welcome. Subway Town's got everything you need. Looking for a race? Head downstairs. Got extra stuff to sell? Then see Janny upstairs. I think you'll like it here. Yeah, I think I will too. Hey stranger, you looking to earn a little on the side? Ooh, yeah! Brick Johnson, the guy that runs the bar, he's been having trouble with bandits stealing his liquor. He needs someone to take care of this problem. Well, I'm a fixer. I fix problems. What do you have to say, Remus? I've been told. All right. Well, apparently upstairs is where it's at. Look around. All of this is redstone stuff. Damn the meanest? Okay, I'm a fixer. I can, uh... I can, uh... Hey, fix a problem or two. Hey, what, Vincent? What do you have to say for yourself? Do you have anything to say? Do you have anything to say at all? You don't have anything to say? <laughs> the reds follow me everywhere around. And we got the uh, the guy from Prototype's brothers here. And we got at least we got some backup. I'm gonna go and uh, take a guess and say this is where I need to be going. Hold it right there. No, I'm gonna you call it closer. This new guy. Maybe. What's it to you? Tattoos. Okay. Angry man. You're new. That means that you don't exactly know how things work around here. Well, I can take a wild so guess. It's clear to you. This is my place. My town. And every bastard here answers to me. What I want, they do. So if you can help me two things, then we'll be fine. If not, then I have no use for you. 
Got that. Why don't you skip the speech and get to what you need? Get things done. Let's give you a little test, huh? My foreman is having mutant problems at the end of the blue line tunnel. The things keep crawling back in. So go help him out. If you can have good, <laughs> yeah. prove yourself useful to me. And then I'll let you stay. Now, show me what you can do. And get the hell out of here. Huh, I'm going to steal your Blake bobblehead. I'm going to do that first off. I'm going to steal that Blake bobblehead. I don't know where the Blake reference comes in. It's probably something from Id's Pass, I'm guessing. Probably a character from either Quake... Quake. I imagine Quake, because I don't know Quake that well. I never really got into Quake. The Fez Bar. 